month with Thanksgiving, I want us to carry this going forward into the month of December and beyond. This upcoming season can get so busy and so hectic that it's easy to forget about the true meaning of the holidays. Many times our focus is on giving or receiving the perfect gift and running from gathering to party to gathering. But today I want to talk about the importance of gathering and supporting people at this time of year. It is the season of shopping and gathering gifts, but are you in the game of gathering people? I don't know about you, but in the past Christmas seasons, I get so excited about giving and getting, but feel disappointed at the end of the day when it's all over. I absolutely love giving, which is why this is my favorite season and holiday. I will search high and low for the perfect gift just to see the excited and surprised expression on their face when they open it. That is the best. But I think I find disappointment when we spend all this time shopping, wrapping, and then it's all over so fast. Now I'd also be lying if I didn't say that I love getting also. And this is probably where more of the disappointment lies as I think I spend too much time focusing on the wrong thing and too much anticipation of what I will get, which can sometimes be followed by a letdown. Now, I hope I'm not the only one feeling like this, but I want to be open and I want to be honest with you because I can look back and see that I probably was not living in the moment, which I'm going to endeavor to do better this year and would love to encourage you to do the same. Doug and I are actually cutting back this year in our gifts to one another because we have more than enough. And so I'm determined to make the most of what is given and not feel that disappointment especially because the reason that we are cutting back is to help another family in need. What's better than that? Nothing, and I know that, so I'm excited for this season. So with all of this being said, I just wanna encourage you to help each other as we move into the holiday season, giving back in a grateful way to others, giving your time, helping others, and learning what the true meaning of this season is, and then, you are not disappointed when you were intentional with what you gave, especially in the form of your time. And so to live this out, set a different expectation of what your holiday will look like. I think this is so important as we set different expectations, we will have a better outcome and feel full of joy instead of disappointment. And time is so crucial. It's the only thing that we cannot get back. Oh, my niece came home from college this past weekend, and it was so wonderful spending extra time with her. That's why today is called the present. It's a gift. And so to do this, I want to encourage you to find opportunity to create new memories with people. Have a game night. Watch a Christmas movie with a friend. Bake some cookies with a family member. Volunteer your time and connect with new individuals. We are more likely to remember the time we have shared with others and the memories created is a gift that will last us a lifetime. Thanks for joining me today. See you soon.